last lot, and I welcome you to a regular YouTube channel. At any rate, we provide online training on training technologies to involve the best instructors and clinical services. So today I'm here to give you a full overview of our training. The training web driver is a web-based automation testing framework which can test web pages, initiation, on various web browsers, and operating systems. In fact, you can also find test scripts in different programming languages such as Java, Python, Ruby, C Sharp, PHP, and JavaScript. Following this demand for warfare, we have come up with this training framework for the course, which is divided into 10 modules. The first module is a tutorial series covering all the possible basic concepts in training driver. Some of those include. Oh, shut up! No talking in the videos. Never mind, no bad! And how slain fares compared to other tools. The third module will give you a quick introduction of the remaining slain fares we took to was before. You will learn how slain is used in the industry, and you will also learn about a few real time projects, popular frameworks, and tools it is used with. Module 5 will help you understand various career paths in automation testing and top 5 automation testing trends to be aware of. We will be wrapping up this resource with a section dedicated to helping you prepare for the most frequently asked interview questions. You can now move forward to learn topics in the full course, but before we get started with this session, don't forget to subscribe to our channel and hit the bell icon to stay updated. Also, if you're looking for an online certification lately, check out the link in the description box for this course. So without much ado, let's get started on it. about one of the latest trends in the market that is Selenium. So this video it will mainly focus on helping you guys understand what exactly is Selenium. But before we get any further with this session, let's take a look at the agenda. So firstly, we'll start off with talking about the history behind the growth of Selenium and also we'll take a look at what exactly is Selenium, its definition, its features and components and finally we'll wrap up this session by taking a simple demo. So these are the topics guys and also on this note don't forget to subscribe to Eddie Wake's YouTube channel and hit the bell icon to never miss any notifications from us on coming technology. Certification training and automation testing, check out the link in the description box below. So let's get started, guys. As you all know, Selenium is an open source tool which is used for automating the tests carried out on different web browsers. But what do you think is the history behind it? What do you think are the major reasons that affected the growth of Selenium? Let's have a look, guys. So, this Selenium was originally developed by Jason Hawkins in the year 2004 as an internal tool while he was working at ThoughtWorks. So, Hawkins later joined the programmers or uh, the testers at ThoughtWorks and tried to develop Selenium RC. So, this tool was developed in the year 2004 by uh, two developers, mainly Jason Hawkins and Paul Hammond. So it was open sourced in the same year, guys. So Selenium RC was the first one to be found among the web driver Grid and Selenium IDE. In 2005, Dan Fabrich and Nelson Sproul made an offer to accept a series of patches that would transform Selenium RC into what it is known for today. So. I'm just leaving the webcam. I'm just making a quirk.